and nail it down and you will never come back. Alabasta is the 16th largest city in Alabama. Huntsville is the third largest. And you know, the, the mayor of Alabama is Handlon. The wicked fall into the hands of the living God and he destroy them. He put them aside, bind them, bind the tears, put them in the Ghana for the fire. Now, now the third city in Alabama is Huntsville. We call it the Rocket City and the mayor is Tommy Battle. We are ready to tread down the powers of darkness, tread them and wipe them out from the face of the earth. And you know that the, the mayor is battle. And then you have another city in Alabama that is Helena. It's called Old Town Helena. The mayor is Mark Hall. God is saying, the banquet hall is ready. It is supper time. Do you know that? That's why they say, sweet home Alabama. Sweet home Alabama is the one who helped the woman, opened her mouth and swallowed it. And then the earth becomes sweet. No more poisonous tears. Do you know that the colors of the Alabama um, tells about the separation too? The red cross in the, in the middle of the flag tells us that it's the bloodstained banner of Prince Emmanuel. And the white is the white of surrender. The wicked have to surrender. They capture the sin. Sin elements in the church. Bind them and rope them up so they have no free sway for their total destruction. That's why the colors are red and white. Surrender. Cease fire. Cease fire. And we get the victory in the red. The cross is powerful. And do you know that? Again, Alabama is the 22nd state that joined the Union. You know that 20, 22 is the, um, 22, the number 22 stands for Chi, C-H-I. That's the 22nd letter of the Greek alphabet, Chi. And in Melchizedek, you have the word Chi. Chi, yes, which means life, life and vitality, breath. So God restores us right there in Alabama, sweet Alabama, 22nd letter of the Greek alphabet. That is why you have um, Chichibodo. The, the, some of them are holler, some are ball. The ones who holler, rejoice, hallelujah, our king has come. And those who ball, those are the five wise virgins, you know. And those who are bad, they are the ones who have lost out of the kingdom. They did not accept the message. The shepherd's rod message that has come to save us. The life-saving message. So they hold the head and ball. They are the white in the flag. And those who are covered by the blood. And the five wise virgins. They holler and shout for joy. Yes. So, here we have it. Dorian is a gift. And those who are come to the door and are welcomed in are the five wise virgins. Those who come to the door are not too late. They went back to get the truth, but it was too late. They come to the door and the door was closed. Now we also hear now of another hurricane or a storm brewing called Humberto. Humberto. And this means bright. The light has shone in dark places. Rise up. It's time for us to go home. It's time for us to leave this sin-convulsed, death-weary, hapless world. It cannot continue for much longer. Please. Then, Satan has suffered his third defeat. He couldn't catch, capture the, the, the closing work for the church is 144,000. The sealing of the 144. That has been accomplished. You know what is going to happen? Or what has happened? Um, Markle is making a, a guest editing a, a Vogue magazine and she left out a little space in one of the, on the cover. With, on, amidst all the faces, there's a blank space. 
and that's us. The 144,000 living saints that have the seal of the living God without guile in our mouths who are ready to go into all the world with this precious gospel message. This is the gospel truth. He has arrived. He's ready to take us to the promised land. There we will wash, we will get a, a, a fountain. There will be a fountain open for sin and uncleanness. Nobody will say in the kingdom, I am sick. There will be all joy. We will make wine presses and drink the wine there, grow vineyards. And the, the, the child will play on the cockatrice's den. And nobody will hurt in my holy mountain. And everybody will rejoice at this good news. It's good news. This is the manna that you need to feed on and be blessed. And so, we know that after, after the church is delivered, this enemy will go to war. But we know that in Alabama, there was total surrender because you had the white flag of surrender and the red cross of Calvary doing its work. Christ, our high priest, has gotten us the victory and we need not be afraid. We can say hallelujah. The great controversy has ended in the flood. Thank you and may God bless you richly.